What's going on guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new video. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to boost your YouTube channel in 2020 using Movavi Video Editor Plus because you need to properly edit your videos in order to boost your channel, create better content to attract new viewers and obviously turn them into subscribers. So obviously we're going to get started right after the intro. Alright guys, so as you can see right now, we are on the Movavi Video Editor Plus 2020. First of all, this video is going to show you how to use the program, but it's also ma like mainly about how to, you know, start a YouTube channel properly in 2020, because if you want to start a channel this year, obviously the competition is really high and you need obviously high quality videos in order to attract people and stuff. And that's where Movavi Video Editor Plus 2020 comes in really, really handy. Now, before I'm going to get into the software and show you guys like how to create an intro, how to make a thumbnail, all that. We have set up a 30% discount code and you can obviously use that code on the ready to use intro library and additional intro packs on the website itself. I will leave the link down below. You can also have like these packs that you can just pick up with 30% discount. Don't miss out on this offer guys. This is just really, really amazing that they are so fortunate enough to set us up with a 30% discount, which you can obviously find down in the description. When you want to start a YouTube channel in 2000, 2020, like I mentioned, the quality needs to be really high. And obviously with this program that can be arranged with ease. So I'm going to show you guys exactly, you know, how to use it. I'm going to guide you through the program. So this is basically the interface that you will have when you open up the program. So on the very right, we have our big preview screen. So we will see what we have created so far at the bottom. Very obvious, like most editors, we have our timeline where we're going to do all the cutting, the syncing, everything like that. And we also are here have this menu where you can add in files and import your video clips and then on the very left we have like the media bin where you will see all your files below that we have like sound effects that you can import into your program below that we also have music if you have for example a vlog and you want to add music into it you also have like this sample video which obviously contains like moving assets for example like falling money we have flames we have like a candle we have like bubbles we have clouds we have a countdown anything you can imagine is in this software obviously we also have background so let's say that you want to create a thumbnail for example you just want to basically drag that into your timeline and then you can start working from there adding text adding yourself as you know transparent as a png it's really really cool okay so now the main question is why would you actually use video editor plus you know above any other software beside the fact that it's really really affordable it is just a really good software if you want to edit like really quick and efficiently in other softwares you mainly have to like download like sound effects from youtube and drag them into you know your software right here you don't have to go to Google and Google, for example, like Blue Gradient, because you already have them in here. The sound effects, everything right here is just included in the program a lot easier than just going onto Google and to YouTube and, you know, spend like half an hour, you know, downloading all kinds of files and sound effects and songs that you want to use. So that's just basically a really, really good thing. And obviously we have like these pre-made, you know, titles and all. It's just the options are endless, guys. Before we're going to dive into some advanced, you know, like editing and showing how to use it and make thumbnails all that we also have four buttons right here which says record a video it's going to open up this box where you can actually like select your webcam i just have it covered up so that's why it's black but you can you, you guys know what i'm trying to say it's really handy that you can just actually like click on start capture and then it will actually like be in your software directly so that's a really really cool feature that you can just record your webcam straight into the software not a lot of programs are able to do that but next to it we also have like capture for example like a screen so obviously right here it says record your screen with mobile video suite capture screencasts and video tutorials record online music and videos record skype calls webinars web conferences so you can click on buy now or you can just obviously use the free trial okay so next to it, it is also the same but then for audio you can just click on there select your microphone and then you can start recording at the very bottom it is just recording our voice in the timeline it is really cool if you have for example like gaming footage and you want to record your voiceover that's a really really handy thing as well okay so right here this is an interesting one it says quick video so if you click on that this box will prompt and let's just go ahead and select an intro okay so i selected the intro of an upcoming video and right here it is basically loaded in so we can click on templates this is kind of like an intro maker random transitions and you can create like your own little intro with like transitions different types of text what your channel is about all that so you have many different choices to choose from 
uh, for example like if you have a travel channel you can just click on there use this one so we're gonna cl now click on music and we have all kinds of different genres and different choices so I'm gonna let you guys decide which one would actually fit best I think for like a travel vlog something uplifting would be like fit the most so then you can click on a preview and then it is basically just a matter of like you know checking it out and how does it look and just going back and making the adjustments and all that it's really really cool so right here you can just you know type in the text it says the trip of my dream so I'm just going to for example like type in Movavi video editor and then below that I'm gonna type in full tutorial so then we're gonna click on apply and then it's going to apply the changes hit preview once more so as you can see right now, it says Movavi Video Editor Full Tutorial, and it is really cool. And if you say like, okay, I'm happy with this end result, you can just click on Export, and then you can just save it as a video, continue to manual mode, or upload it online. Or you can upload it to YouTube, to Google Drive, to Vimeo, any kind of platform. So that looks really, really cool. So let's just go ahead and start from scratch. Okay, so now we're gonna edit a little small video. I'm gonna show you how to apply filters and how to cut it and everything. So this is basically a intro of one of this mini series. What we're gonna also do is spice up this clip a little bit by some color grading. So we're gonna go to the filters button and we're gonna click on color filters. So then we can actually like scroll through like which one would actually fit. So I think this one looks very nice. So let's drag that onto our clip and let's see what that looks like. I think it's a little blue. So we're gonna press control Z to undo that. And then we're gonna just make sure to just keep looking and try different like try different templates make sure that it's nice and cinematic so I don't want it to turn like way too dark so I'm just going to just drag on a couple templates and see which one would actually be nice okay I think this one looks very good as well so as you can see that looks really really cool so let's just go ahead and start cutting and you know make sure that we will you know remove all the pauses and everything what's going on guys my name is Alex welcome back to a brand new video and in this tutorial I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to boost your YouTube channel in 2020 using Movavi Video Editor Plus. Okay, so as you can see right here, I pause. So we're gonna press Control B, and then I'm gonna also cut that off. So I'm gonna start off right here on the next line. You need to proper. You need to properly. So I'm gonna just press Control B once more, and then I'm gonna delete that part. So this is what the jump cut looks like so far. Editor Plus, you need to properly edit your video. So as you can see, that looks really, really cool. Okay, so right here, another jump cut. I'm gonna press Control B. And then right here, when the sound wave starts again, press Control B once more, delete that part. And what's really cool is once you actually delete something out of like between these two clips, it will actually connect it to each other. That's a really cool feature as well. Okay, so then I say, we're gonna start it right after the intro. Then I'm going to press Control B again. And then I'm not gonna use my regular intro like I always use. So I'm gonna just use a little intro that's from here. So I'm gonna also make a custom one. So we're gonna go to the titles menu and I'm going to pick for example like this one I'm gonna drag that onto my timeline okay so then we're gonna customize this so I'm going to double click on the text and I'm gonna type in my name I think my full name is gonna be like a little too long so I'm just gonna also make my make my name size a little smaller let's say that we're gonna put this one to 120 that looks really cool and then we're gonna add in for example like the below text for example how to start a YouTube channel in 2020 okay so let's just play this back So that looks really cool already, but I think there are a couple things missing, which is obviously like a nice background because as you can see right here, it is just black, transparent. So we're going to just add in a background. So we're going to go to the media library and we're going to pick backgrounds. And let's just say that we're going to pick a really cool gradient. For example, that one, we're going to drag it underneath, obviously the clip. This one is a little bit too short. So let's drag this as long as that text is and let's add some music as well okay so let's pick this action movie clip because we would just want to make the viewer excited for what's coming because they're curious about how to start the channel so let's play it back right after the intro and we can make it like fade in for example like this after the intro
Okay, guys, so I know this is like really, really basic, but you guys know what I'm trying to say, you know, like how to add in overlays, how to add in text. And of course, if you want to like skip this entire progress, have something a little more advanced, make sure to just go over to the website and use the 30% discount code you can find down below because right here you will see like what you will find in that actual template. This is like, it contains like eight videos that you can completely customize. So this is like a really, really cool glitch intro, very advanced. So that basically means that you can skip the, you know, creating an intro from scratch process. But if you want to just go ahead and use a template, you can just find the link down in the description box and you can use also that code and get started because the VHS is not the only one. We have like a lot more in store for you for like fantasy and all that. So let's just click on it and let's see what one template looks like, like multiple pre-made templates for you to use. And there's so much more on the website, guys. I highly recommend you to check that out. And guys, this software is also available for Mac if you are wondering and if you want to hop over to the actual store you just want to go to help and then you see the Movavi store but also the Movavi FX store for example like this human robots art bundle they have like a starter bundle they have fantasy sound packs doesn't matter what you really need they have you covered Okay guys, so let's remove everything from our timeline. Now you guys know like the basic about how to edit this video. And if you want to like have more advanced videos about editing in Movavi Video Editor Plus, make sure to let us know in the comments down below. So right now we're gonna move on to creating a thumbnail. So a thumbnail is a little bit more easy than videos because you don't need to, you know, cut and synchronize and all that. So we're gonna start off with the background. You can use any other background. It doesn't have to necessarily be from Movavi Video Editor Plus. So let's just click on this one. So we're gonna pretend that we're a food channel and that we have for for example created a new dish and we want to create a thumbnail for that video so now we have a really cool background already let's just move on to obviously you guys can already guess it it is the text so we can just for example pick this one so let's just go ahead and click on here so let's pretend that we have a cooking channel and I don't know I'm just gonna type in uh, random cooking because because let's because you're going to just pretend that you will fill in the name of your cooking YouTube channel. So then we're going to just, for example, like type in our dish name. So then we want to make sure that we will select everything that we have edited and we can also make it smaller right here. And we can also just place that nice at the top. Then we can also add in another text layer, for example, this one, add that into our timeline. And then we can just also edit that text layer as well. Let's pretend that this dish is ready in five to 10 minutes like that. We can also make that text a lot bigger and for example place it like nice vertically centered like that and then what you can also do to spice things up is just go to the stickers and you can also just like look food related stickers and place them in there for example like this fire emoji you can just also make that one smaller and you can add in multiple stickers as well so it's really really simple guys and if you are ready with making your thumbnail what you want to do is obviously take a snapshot from your preview if you want to go ahead and pick up this program along with a lot more intro packs from the website. And guys, before I'm gonna let you go, I want to mention that you can pick up this program along with three intro packs uh, through the link in the description down below with a 30% discount, so don't miss out on this. This is how to do it. So guys, that's it for this video. I want to thank Movavi for sponsoring this video. I'll catch you guys in a brand new video, obviously, very, very soon. If you like this video, make sure to hit the like button down below, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys, obviously, in my next video.